Hey everyone, welcome back. In today's update, we're diving into a developing story out of the Philippines that's causing quite a stir. Recently, the Chinese embassy in Manila made a bold claim concerning the South China Sea, or as it's known locally, the West Philippine Sea. According to them, the armed forces of the Philippines Western Command, in collaboration with key Philippine officials from the Department of National Defense and the National Security Council, have agreed to a new model for managing the long-standing disputes over these contentious waters. This isn't just any agreement. The Chinese claim stretches back to a 2016 deal during the Duterte administration. They assert that the Philippines agreed not to deploy vessels or aircraft beyond 12 nautical miles of Scarborough, significantly limiting the area available for Filipino fishermen. Now, here's where it gets tricky. The Philippine government is pushing back hard against these claims. They say no such agreement exists, and what's more, they accuse China of spreading misinformation. It's a classic case of, he said, she said. But with the added complexity of international diplomacy and regional security. Why is this important, you might ask? Well, the South China Sea is a major global trade route and is rich in resources. Whoever controls this area holds not just economic power, but significant strategic military leverage in Southeast Asia. The statements from the Chinese embassy have stirred up quite the controversy, leading to warnings from the Philippine agencies about the potential for misinformation to sow discord among the Filipino people. To sum it up, this situation is a complex web of historical tensions, national pride and geopolitical strategy playing out in public view. And as always, it's the local communities, especially the fishermen, who face the most immediate impact from these high-level political maneuvers. We'll definitely keep an eye on how this story develops and what it means for the region. Stay tuned and don't forget to hit like and subscribe for more updates on this and other pressing news stories. Until next time.